unsettled. Okay, Chris, you're going to kick us off. Once again, please. The verdict, the verdict, the verdict, the, verdict. the summary. Yes, sir. The first for today. Um, yeah, we knew, I said it before the game, we knew it before the game, because Paris is a really strong side for a specific kind of playing football, so three things they do. The first long ball to, from Hennessy was obviously a really long ball. Um, then if they win this, this long ball, then it's already dangerous. If they win a second ball but cannot go through, then they play on the wing, cross Christian Bentig. Rest is counter attack. So good. They are strong in this, quick players and all that stuff. So we knew it. And we dominated the game with all with all the threats around each play, each, each ball you lose could be a counter attack. Each ball Hennessy has or another player has is immediately a long ball. Then take and this long ball then you have to defend really clear because if you don't, then it's a foul and then wherever it is, it's again a set piece from Hennessy. Um, or another player, so only to explain his circumstances. So, but we did well. So it was not perfect, of course not. It was not the most exciting game, but we all have to learn that these games are not exciting. If you open it with one nil, and you, what we did, and you can then score the second, then the opponent maybe change style of play, and then again there are spaces which they are not used to give away, and you can use it. We couldn't because we we gave them the opportunity out of nothing to f score the first goal. It's one, one long line ball, one cross, and been taken alone in the box. There's no excuse for nothing to, good to say about it was this moment. Um, you could see immediately that they, 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 the confidence grew, obviously, in this moment. They have to start playing football only two minutes because there was the final the halftime whistle. But we, we knew um, all the things we did, passing these, these balls between the lines. We had Roberto, especially Ginny and Phil, a lot of times between the lines. They could turn. We could have used these balls a little bit better. We wanted to involve Debok a little bit more because Debok made good ways, but we didn't play in this line. If they want to win the ball, it's a foul. If Div does it in a good way, would be a threat for them also, how we could see with Phil's um, um, free kick ability. So, did it again. Um, out of nothing, we give the corner away. This corner is now really strange. I know how often we spoke about uh, set pieces, but we cannot speak about defending set pieces. If we hit the ball at the first post, then it's a bad corner. So, so we didn't hit it. And um, so it's a goal. That's how it is, probably. Yeah, it made the game not easier. So um, we had to go again. We changed a little bit, a few things, system, broad wingers. Um, with Trent then and Alberto to make the game wide. We had then Marco on the pitch as another header threat and um, wanted to have Roberto in the box and Ginny and Phil around for second balls and that stuff. <clears throat> but how everybody could see, especially in for the extra time, we lost a little bit of nerves. It was not clear anymore. We gave them the opportunity to, to, to win these balls so easy. We had not good formation for second balls. Uh, so couldn't create most of chances in the last five minutes, but we had before again, well, we had Roberto in the box, we had uh, Phil in the box, you can say if it's a penalty or not, you know, everybody told me, yes, if he goes down, it's a penalty, if he don't, it doesn't go down, it's not a penalty, maybe we should think about this, that honesty and desire um, is punished, not sure that it, that makes sense, but it happened. <clears throat> Yeah, we tr at the end we tried everything, not at our best, but not it was not about attitude. The boys tried. Uh, we couldn't we couldn't finalize often enough our our effort, uh, and um, so it feels really frustrating. Of course, it's not it's it's really harsh to accept. When you think about the goals, how they did it. I know about the quality, and it, that's how it is. The counter attacks are really good, and um, we did this well, but obviously. Not well enough. Mm. Paul? I, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty much used to nothing more in my life than to get up after a knock. So that's my, 
nothing happened more often to me than this. So that's um, that's no problem. I, I spoke to the boys after the game. It's no problem for me, and means then, but not nothing today. So I, I spoke to the boys after the game and, and told them, yes, that's it feels frustrating and it's disappointing. Yes, we made these mistakes. That's all true. We have to feel it today. That's how defeats are. They they, they make sense. Defeats always make sense. We don't like it, but you, they, they have there's a reason for not only what you did in the game, also how you re react after the game. So yes, we have around about one and a half days from tomorrow morning's training, and then we have one and a half days to recover from this and we will and then there's one month to go one wonderful month football month four games so um uh, we will not give up 100% not whoever it's it's how it is you could see it today we all need to get used to it much more than we are already are in a game like this there's not biggest excitement possible most of the time but nobody cares usually but obviously we care kind of. I could see it in a few faces. I could see it in a few body language. I could hear it a little bit from outside. It's not passing here. Oh, <clears throat> could have been a better pass and all that stuff. So I think the boys delivered a lot of this excitement. Now it really stays, really. It's about serious football. Do what you have to do, and we will do. We, we tried to do, obviously, today. And two times they, they gave us um, an answer we didn't want. But that's all. And I, I said it now five or six times, all the colleagues. I know a lot of people around think now, oh my God, Champions League slips through our finger again, mm. only if we let it slip. So, because that's all I can say about this. We have to, we have to try everything and we will try everything. Our job is to squeeze everything out of this season, what we can squeeze. Obviously, it's not easy for us, but that's no surprise. Um, and we will see. Maybe Adam is coming back for, for the next game, what of course would help us in different situations. That's good. And um, we have now five or six days to train until Watford. We will use it uh, and then go to Watford. Will not be easy, but possible. That's enough. Chris Matek is an outstanding good striker, so absolutely no doubt about it. But if you leave him alone like we did in the first and around the first goal, then um, I'm not sure that he need, needed all his skills for his goals. Even when you can, a lot of strikers maybe would fail in a moment like this because of, uh, it was not the most easy, probably. But we left him alone, yeah, makes no sense. <clears throat> and the second one, how I said, one player thought maybe they miss it. Uh, so, and yes, they missed it. And this one player reacted. And that's the um, that's our mistake. Nobody else to blame for. Pardon? Injured. I have to, I didn't see it until now. Yeah, yeah. So we defend we defend in we have this kind of space defending. I'm not sure it was really close. Um, there we have four players there in this space. Emre is blocking, yeah, Benteke in this moment, probably but as I didn't see it. Would be not a real surprise for me if somebody blocked Emre that Christian could go there. If you saw it again on television, I'm not sure. But that's a sh a low cross. Yeah, Millie knows that he usually he hits the ball, that's his position, so shoot it away. And how's that? That's a bad corner. So, yes, Benteke usually he gets the ball two meter fifty high. This one, he had to go on his knees. So, um, but it's not important. It's again our, it's our mistake. We, all, we take it all, we, we, we take the responsibility. I take the responsibility for all of this. But again, in this moment, I already uh, want to strike back, but I can't because I have to wait a little bit and um, so, but we will use the time and try everything. You can imagine everything um, um, to make the best of this season and today it feels really bad, but only if we let it have bigger influence, then it has bigger influence. Thanks guys, thank you very much. See you. Bye bye.